This is Jonah Hill, and you're listening to the only podcast that matters. Throw gang, we are joined by the no dumper have an ass, Lauren Schlossman, mm, mm, mm. and myself, Marjorie Taylor Greene's ex lover, not the tantric polyamorous no. sex guru. You, you, you're you're fast. I'm a to the point. I'm a tantric sex apprentice. Yeah, uh, James you're, Harris. You're still learning. I'm a novice. <laughs> I'm an apprentice. Welcome to the weekly running of the boys. With today's full episode only mm. available on Patreon.com/slash Throwing Fits. Lawrence, my cheetah spotted friend, how are you? I'm great, dude. Uh, we've had a, a crazy week. How are you? Um, yo, this week's been nutty. Uh, yeah. Big things coming soon. Sure, always. Thing on doy, Monday. No doy. Dropped a blastic with Reese the Flair on Tuesday. Mm-hmm. What happened Wednesday? Wednesday we had some shit. I totally Dropped forget. The merch. Dropped the merch on Wednesday, and then yo, <laughs> uh, I was like, and then we have we're fucking doing three pods this week. I was trying to fit in a fit pick for yeah. our best friends seasons. And I'm taking it over here in Greenpoint. I'm just clomping around in my fucking Wagache loafers. Right. That's a so you're going and solo dolo. You're on self yeah. timer life. Yeah. Right. And I'm like, yo, the sun's out. Good lighting. Uh, got some free time. I I pose in front of this house that um, had something interesting going on in front of it. Oh, and, no spoilers. You're going to. Well, I might go back at some point uh, on, on my ninja shit and I prop up my phone in the snow. <laughs> you, and I take be so bold. I take a test, a test fit pick because I'm a professional and I get my phone and I'm walking off because I'm embarrassed. And I'm like, yo, maybe of I'll course. come back later. And I'm looking at it. And I'm like, you know what? It's kind of fire. So I turn around <laughs> and go back and there's this fucking gigantic Polish man in his like 50s. And he's like, hey, hey. Like, yeah. He's like. <laughs> You take a picture, you take a photograph. And I'm like, was he yeah, drunk? no. I, was he drunk? Yeah, I think so. I mean, it was, <laughs> no, it was, it was 3 p.m. Yes. Yes. 3 p.m. Yes! Old Polish yes! Greenpoint. Um, had to be. Uh, <laughs> yeah, right. He's like, you take a photograph. I'm like, yeah, I took a picture. He's like, oh, uh, he's like mumbling, like trying to think of some English shit. Um, <laughs> he's like, uh, you steal package. I'm like, what? He's like, you, you steal a package. I'm like, no. He's like, okay. We just like stand there for like 20 seconds. Did he, was it his house? No, no. He's just neighborhood watch. Yeah, yeah. And we got a fucking package thief on the loose. Exactly. Greenpoint. Um, probable cause. Someone and probably got their fucking jaws lifted. <laughs> and this man is going to get to the fucking bottom of it. I'm like, you think I still, you think I'm like a thief? I'm in like fucking gigantic loafers and yeah. a big gas fit, which you'll see uh, the fit pick was taken elsewhere eventually. Uh, like Drake from State Farm, like a good neighbor, drunk Polish guy is there. <laughs> Oleg to, was there to, to to have your back and make sure that that James isn't cruising around taking flicks and pilfering John. I've never been fucking chased off the fit pick scene before, but you know, there's a first, this is again, this is a crazy. You gotta week. be like me, and you got to roll with a shooter. <laughs> You're in house shooter. <laughs> the one thing, and we're gonna do the chicken nugget, the chicken McNugget, yes. the cactus Jack chicken McNugget body pillow reveal. The only way that it would be better is if it had appendages that could like take a fit pick or like it was a tripod because oh, it word, is word. human size. All right. Well, we'll get to that. Um, Speaking of which, let's do, a, let's, let's do a fit check, baby. Yeah. So this is not the fit that got me chased out of Greenpoint, <laughs> um, but <laughs> off North Henry. Soupy's on the feet. Then some like camping socks. It was kind of what, fucking what risk on camping socks. I don't know. They're just like, uh, they're not like wigwam, but you know, they're of that like family of that world. Yeah. Of that world of the um, TJ Maxx clearance rack. Exactly. EG subtle print. Soft boys on the ass. Nice. Uh, you got a nice cuff on those trousers. Yeah, robust, right? There, there's going to be a whole conversation debate about oh, it's cuff, cuffing season, baby. About about cuffed robustness yep. at some point in the future. That's what we call a big thing coming. Keep um, it locked. Watch this space. <laughs> our Lagache boxers, which I don't wear often enough. Oh, the the Stussy Laguchis. Yeah, this, the Stussy Laguchi workshop. Shout out Yolkum with the big. What would you normally wear? Like more like a PJ situation? Like no, just like the uh, lounge. Uh, I, I'm, I do I do this thing where I always and this is like something I've learned over the 26 years I've been alive. Um, yeah. I always save clothes for like a special occasion, even boxers. I'm like, yo, these are my these are my good boxers for like a date or something. No, for like uh, a day where I need like when extra. You're, when confidence. you're hooking up with a groupie, you want her to see the the Stussy yeah, Laguchi. Exactly. <laughs> um, so so I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna wear my good boxers today. for pod day. This is a special occasion. Yeah. So it's coming up on launch day, and sure. then. Um, I got this very nice knit, I love that. Uh, zip polo from our boys, Conrad and Mickey, the co-creators of HBO's industry, put us on to this brand, Basic Rice. They came through with the package. You got yours just now. Um, it's really nice. It's fucking it soft. Is, I it feel is like a, I'm going to be tucking that shit in 
Oh yeah, you ASAP. Are. Well, I really like the the ribbed cuff because I was like wearing it. And it kind of rides Classy. up. Uh, it rides up a little bit, but yeah. I felt like a fucking media mogul on Succession, sure. but with like the rock star hardware a little bit. Conrad was telling me he's like uh, one of the guys or the founder himself is in a band, so they do have this like jaggery type. So it's of like vibe an, well, like an art, Arctic Monkeys kind of that yeah. kind of. Lab. I don't know if that's a diss or not. No, that's a compliment. Okay. Um, I think you look good on the dance floor. Um, I told, I told Conrad yeah. I, was, I was wearing this to uh, the rap party, not the afters. We'll be shirtless at the afters. Right, but of course. Conrad, Mick. Titties out. See you in, see you in Cardiff, mates. Yeah. What about I, yourself? I love that. I, I have that in brown. You have it's a nice chocolatey brown. It's somewhere between media mogul and then like Rat Pack, which yeah. is like, honestly, our vibe. I no, it is, it is some like Tony Side. Soprano shit, but with like the. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But then you got like the, the deep the deep zip, which the, for the yo, deep zip with the for robust the, hardware. For the patrons, $10 and up. Here you go. Oh, wow. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, I am That's for sure forever. going to be tucking that in and pissing people off. Yeah, um, please. For me, I am wearing um, entire world socks, um, some pretty thrashed and repaired vintage I Levi's five hundred ones from the motherfucking plug that was shouted out in the most recent Thursday dumper. Yes, sir. Uh, these are vintage five hundred one. Um, I I believe it's an XX. Um, and then I have on yo. We were dropped merch this week. I am wearing actually, you know, let me let me flash a little. Can you guys see the, the little lemon? If lemon you know, dip. you know, um, for the ten dollar best friends. Uh, yo, the tea is selling great. And yeah. I know that like the shorts, the mean green five inch inseam um, cock swinging machines. Those are a cult favorite. But I do believe that this is my favorite thing that we've released. The watercolor on the back. It's Yo, like, Ryland snapped. It's like our ode to, I mean, this is a, this is a Jimmy idea. And you were like, yo, I want to do our version. Shout out Dick Sucking Ron for, for uh, being the muse. Wow. You love that. Uh, it is it our take on what I would say is what? Like vintage restaurant merch. Yeah. It's a little bit of, a, it's a little bit Balthazar. It's a little bit fucking Beach Week. It's somewhere in the middle. We don't we don't fucking listen. We eat at the best of the best and we eat at the worst of the worst and we enjoy them the same. And this is somewhere. This is high low. Rylan snapped. Yeah. He he uh, <laughs> the brush strokes are he, so beautiful. He painted this in the laundromat. Or I guess he drew it and then painted it afterwards. He said that. Yeah. He, the like first waiting for the laundry? first rough sketch sketch was while he was sitting oh, in the laundry. That's right. Like on an iPad or yeah. whatever. His uh, his Microsoft Pro. <laughs> it's just for all the Baroque boys and Baroque yeah. girls out there. Those are little $50 treat. For those you. will be available uh, when you're hearing this uh, uh, the 24 until, hours until so. right until Sunday. Oh, Saturday. Excuse me. Saturday at 10 a.m. Um, shout out to everyone who's already copped. Love these. Can't wait for you to get them in roughly three weeks. Send us the fits. We'll repost. Oh, we'll 100 percent. I love seeing like the merchant uh, last John next John. That exactly. was nice, yeah, too. Yeah. Um, and then on top of that, I got on this beautiful. This is, was also in an old dumper, but this is a second layer um cardigan uh i love this we just got this you got a second layer pack yep i got a second layer pack uh we've been familiar and fans of these guys and homies with these guys since the capsule days they are the most underrated brand in the game in my opinion uh uh full stop they came out blazing hot in i want to say like and this is probably totally wrong like 2013 2014 like that era yeah yeah blazing hot who knows what happened? They've kind of been bubbling under the surface, but it does seem like they're primed to go once again, as evidenced by this beautiful cheetah card. Yep. As evidenced by uh, the pack I got over here. Oh, yeah. Um, and we it's know that they're fans. So, yo, shout out those guys. Yeah. Uh, shout out fucking Josh. Josh. Shout out Jake. Shout out Anna. Anna. Thank you so much again for the support. Um, when they're in New York, we'll have them on the pod. We'll do Absolutely. that. That's uh, You guys need to be exposed to that West Coast elegance. Mm. If you aren't already made in Italy. Mwah. Mamma Mia, Marron. Um, and, <laughs> and the then, panties. And then uh, Supreme Haynes boxers were the Nupsy Hustle and the Bleep Stones. Right. Yeah. You're a big are, fan of those. Yeah. Big the fan canceled of, boots. Big, big fan <laughs> of the Bleep Stones. They are, they are waiting outside of your crib uh, respectfully. And we are drinking our final bottle from the Austin Winery. This is a Pet Nat Repos. What is this? Uh, Reposso. Is that how yes, you, I, that's, that sounds nice good. and juicy? Um, it is fantastic. Thank you to the awesome winery again. Send us free booze. We will probably drink it on pod and you might get your dick sucked. Lawrence, we're approaching uh, the end of the preview here. So I want to get into the podcast, which the first thing we're going to do is oh, shit, snuggle right? test. Oh, yeah. The Cactus Jack, All Travis right. Scott, X McDonald. I'll be right back. I'm going to go chicken grab nugget. It. You haven't seen body pillow, which you were sent two of them. And you were telling me you're like, yo, you will not fucking believe how 
enormous these are. So we kept it the surprise. This is me seeing it. Oh my God. <laughs> 